too hot, baby. Was that cool in the gang? I think it was. No. It was your mom in the gang. <laughs> Back to our stupid reactors, you get some Corbin. Underbeard. I'm Rick. Where can they follow us, Corbin? Can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. It's so, so juicy. juicy. Thank you, my dear. So, some Patreon, follow on Facebook, Twitter account. And if I sound sick, it's because this disease filled monkey got me sick when I told him to get out of my house. It's his paranoia. Nope. Yeah. You got me sick. No. But today. And I'm well, so. Today. Um, don't get me sick again. Well, just sitting next to you makes me sick. Um, it's a little bit of a treat. I don't know if I want to tell you exactly what it is. I think I want to... So it has Ranveer. Ranveer, yeah. Ranveer, he's right behind my ear. It's true. Um, it's an ad. Okay. And with, with I believe Singh. I believe it was his first endorsement deal ever. Okay. So let's... Just. All right, let's do it. And for those of you wondering, I, I wish this was chai, but it's a fine deliciousness of coffee. Mmm. 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 Don't ever do that ever again. Thank you so much. Here we go. <sighs> give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. I was hoping it was all going to be in English. It wasn't. So I'm yeah. sure there was some hilarious stuff that they said in there. 100% uh, lyrically. And that's okay that you didn't wait till we got the subs. I would like to get the subs. So this was his first endorsement, endorsement deal. Endorsement deal. Because I, yeah. I, okay, so the people that, that was. Like, this needs to air in America. Because the condom, they air condom, I don't know how prevalent it is in India. But here they, condom commercials are pretty prevalent. Um, yeah, but it's usually they, just, oh, hook up, hook up, hook up, ooh, steamy, steamy, steamy. Right, they're pretty stereotypical, generic, what you see is what you're going to get with each one of those kind of commercials. Yeah. Used to be back in the day, you only saw them like late night, like when Saturday Night Live was on, you'd see them at that time. But now it's become far more common. Nothing this creative, funny, or catchy. People would be talking about this commercial. This should be, every, this should be a Super Bowl commercial. Yeah, they, honestly, Durex, you could just... Come on, guys. Put it all in English. Do this exact same thing and do it with somebody here you in know, America. Just do it with Rand. Oh, I know, but see, that's a problem. Nobody would know who the heck he is. It doesn't is. matter. It's funny. No, I know. It's it would be funny. great, and it would be funny, and it would be great exposure. In fact, come on, 
you, you, everybody's people. This should have been something that they could have done, especially with the attention Gully Boy's getting now with the Academy and everything. This yeah. could have been a Super Bowl commercial. Came out it happens right around Oscar time. Well, it came out. Maybe they're going to do that. 2014, so it was a while ago. Yeah, but still. Um, but man, you could just you could save some money, direct, and just put it in English. <laughs> S- sincerely, like because that was hilarious. <laughs> you make me go. <laughs> I, I bet we don't even know the half of it because we need to see the rest of the words. Yeah. Sadly, we missed some of the words, but I think we got, I mean, it was pretty funny even with... Best, duh. That was hilarious. Best condom commercial oh. ever seen. And if you're going to have sex, please use protection, you disgusting, disease-filled monkeys. That's just good advice, though. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, uh, I would, this like if if I got like normal commercial, because uh, we both been on commercial auditions. Yes, they're pretty terrible. They suck. Uh, no actor, you very rarely get a commercial audition that you're happy to be doing. Yeah. The nice thing about a commercial is that you know if you book it, you're gonna get paid really, 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 really yeah, well. Yeah, if it's a SAG commercial, they pay really yeah well. really, really well. Uh, but they suck. Uh, yeah, because it's usually just. Look into camera, smile. Oh, my least favorite one and most recent memory was an audition I had for, I don't remember the car. I, uh, let's say it was Mercedes or BMW, whatever. And the, I was given, you know, you walk in and you do the sign and sheet and then you see about 20 other guys there who look, you know, like your type that are all there for the same kind of thing. And you just get a little breakdown, like, a, like two sentences of upper class guy, driving his Mercedes through the hills, happy to be alive. Okay, okay. walk in, there's just a chair, and there's the, the, the director and the casting director and one other assistant that's there, and they want you to sit in the chair. It's like, okay, so here's what you're doing, you're just you're driving the car, you're driving the car, and you're just going around some turns, and then around one turn, you get this look on your face about how good life is, let's see it. <laughs> okay, now you're going, now you go around that turn, and how, how good is life? Give me that look. <laughs> I didn't book it. Because <laughs> you sucked! Because I sucked! But obviously it's different for stars. They make Oh good man, they get stars. they don't do they don't do commercials they don't want to do. Yeah. So uh, but I would love to get this breakdown for this commercial. It's like a condom ad, so you're like, hmm. I don't know, but then <laughs> did you see you see it? It's amazing. Yeah. Like it's a s it's a full song. And oh. also how much did this air in India or is this just an online thing? Maybe it was just an online thing. Could be. Uh, yeah, I don't know. But I, feel I would like, imagine maybe it's just an online ad. I'm not sure if anybody else I can think of in India could do this type of commercial. Not no. Because that just looked like Ranveer. Exactly, and that's his image. Yeah. His image has been the, the, the party boy, wild, crazy guy. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, it's just that's a funny oh. that's just a funny commercial. And yes, 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 it the commercial does perpetuate the stereotypes that I hate, and I I am not a fan of. I'm a big fan of monogamy. Let's just put it that way. So, mm. but he's got the Playboy image, and you can differentiate something that's just done for fun and image mm. versus something that's done that's supposed to be propagating. And by the way, everybody, for the kids out there, you got kids. Parent your kids. Don't blame it on commercials for taking their minds in certain directions. Talk to them about sex. Talk to them about condoms. But when also, they're, when they're what, three, four? Is that what you're going to do with your son? I've already talked to him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> but yes. That surprise me. But yes. Please, 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 please use protection. You diseased, disgusting, filled monkeys. <sighs> because regardless of if we want people to or not, I'm going to say people so. are going to have sex. And I'm not, I'm not. I'm I mean, not. not you because you're disgusting. Well, that's how you got sick, but we're not going to tell them. Oh. That. <laughs>